Good afternoon. So, lots happened in the last 36 to 48 hours, right? Well, one thing's happened. A lot of people have a lot of feelings about it, which is great, you know? You know, but will we as a Western society continue to take each problem we have and kick it down the road, or will we deal with it, you know? Or are we going to start listening to the masses or... Um, you know, say that like, oh, we've got, you know, or will our leaders begin to um, help change things more sufficiently than, than pacifying? I mean, there's, there's a lot of, I mean, the, for me, the most troubling thing to look at with the election is that, you know, I think it's 46% of the American population that has the opportunity to vote didn't. Like, that to me is a glaring problem. Either the disillusionment of people in general, that they don't even want to be involved, um, or don't care, or can't be bothered, or can't get off work, or, you know what I mean? Like, I mean, the election day should be a, a national holiday. We have stupider holidays, and that's arguably the, one of the most important things in the country, you know? People shouldn't have to balance going to work or standing in line for hours at a time, they should just be able to go and vote. Um, so will we as a society, Western society, because look, it happened in Britain, Brexit, there's like other elections coming up in France, I think, and you know, well, is everybody just gonna backlash? I mean, look, Trump is like, he is every American stereotype and it's ridiculous. We'll see what happens. Like. You know, if the system is, if the, if he breaks the system, all we can do is go up from here. That's my opinion. Like, all we can do is do better now. You know, uh, I don't think the whole, like, I'm going to take my ball and go home. Like, like okay, like, look, this happened. It, it happened. I'm not happy about it, but, you know, okay. Deal, we, we get to deal with it. We, will we change? That's the question. Like, let's get involved. Do things differently. You know, let's change the electoral college. Like that, that's been a problem for a long time. People that are like, oh, when you don't get your way, that's when it becomes the problem. Like that's just childish, you know? That's my opinion. Like all the principles that I do my best to live by, I, sh I, 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 I try to look through that looking glass of those, through those principles, my vision through those principles. and. You know, what can I do? How can I accept the situation? How can I do better? How can I help make this a better place to, to live, to exist? I'm, I'm optimistic. I'm, you know, is there going to be some rough times? Sure. And I'm not, you know, I know that I'm white-ish because I'm, but I, you know, like I don't have some of those impending problems, but, and I think that they, those are, you know, Race, color, creed, all that stuff are all issues that need to be handled. And it might be some rough going first, you know. Okay. I'm, you know, let's, let's help defend the people that need defending. And I'm all about that. So uh, will we change? That's the question. We have a question to ask ourselves. Will we change? I think we will. I think we will. I'm hopeful. I'm, po you know, I have positive vibes towards this. I hope you do too. I'm not doom and gloom. I don't think this is the end of the world. This is the beginning. Like, you know, this is the this is the beginning of some rough times, but we can only go up. Only go up from here, man. He is he is the lowest, in my opinion. And maybe he'll you know, maybe he's just a windbag and he's gonna actually do some good, but I think he's a windbag, but so cool. All right. I'm babbling.